After installation, start the program. View the interface. First, we will import our mail accounts. Click the file containing your email accounts. As you can see the mail accounts are imported. You have many options to configure your mails with this easy to use program. Click the settings tab and view the import options. Configure delimiters which are used in your text files which contain your mail account. When importing, you may choose to empty your current mail lists and overwrite with a new database by clicking empty database on import. By clicking the default value for delete checks, all of your imported accounts will be flagged to be deleted after email master downloads the mails. You can manually choose your mail client server via the pop-up menu seen here. Exporting is easy. Click export to CSV to export all mails in the database. Name your file and click save. All mail accounts are now saved. We will now import our save file. Make sure to change your delimiter to a comma when importing any CSV file as shown here. Before importing we delete the database by clicking empty database. Now we click import. Select our CSV file. And our mails are now ready. You can delete single accounts easily by clicking delete account. Similarly, you can add a single account manually by clicking add account. Enter the username. Enter the password. Enter your host. Clicking delete mail will flag mails on the host to be deleted after download. Clicking the active button will flag this account to be downloaded when the program runs. Clicking save will store the mail if the mail is authenticated. Otherwise you will receive a message that the mail credentials are not accurate as shown here. Now you never have to log in to view or edit your mail messages again for only $10. Enjoy the program and lifetime updates to everyone in the community. Thanks for watching.